Hey y'all, Edward the Lego Texan here with another speed build for you. Today we're building set 76224, Lego DC Comics Batmobile, Batman versus the Joker Chase. Uh, 438 pieces, retails for $48 in the US. And this uh, released in 2023. And no, this brick built... Um, Batmobile looks very nice. I like the detailing of this. It looks very much like the Keaton Batman, who is my Batman, of course. Uh, and very much from the look of this, it looks like we get a very good approximation of the Jack Nicholson Joker. Um, looking forward to building this. Uh, so let's go ahead and get to it.
Hey y'all, welcome back for my review of the Batmobile, Batman vs. Joker, Joker Chase, and uh, just finished building it. Uh, I'm going to start to start off talking about the minifigures, get those out of our way. I'm going to start with the Joker minifigure. I love the torso printing on the front, even got some small detail on the back too. I'm getting very uh, Jack Nicholson vibes off of this uh, this Joker, very cool, I like that a lot. Um, the Batman, also actually very nice too. Um, very Keaton vibes on this, especially on the printing on the suit on the front and underneath the cape. Uh, the helmet I do like is a separate piece that comes off. He's got two different face choices, um, but the, the cowl itself has the white eyes printed directly on it. I think that was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, that's the minifigure selection. Now I'm talking about the main model. Here it is. Um, nicely detailed for a $48 Batmobile. Uh, nice brick uh, detailing on the sides. You can see that they're all that brick built right there. Um, when you move, when you drive, the tires, the flame in the back spins. Pretty cool little play function right there. The cockpit hood or the roof does come off and you can position your Batman minifigure on the inside. Very, very nice uh, play function on that one. Also, another play function that I really like is the little knob here on the side. You turn it and it pops off. Those two pieces revealing guns uh, hidden inside. Um, I like some of the part usage in this as well, uh, particularly on the back. You see here, on the ex there's these two exhaust ports right here. These are actually just like the handheld binoculars uh, attached to a stud here on the back. Uh, very, very cool on that. Um, I also like the the side air intake uh, manifolds here. They do fold out, but they're like kind of door elements or window elements right there, which, which was also very cool. You've got the window screens in there if you can see through that or not um but very very nicely detailed you know which i'm actually pleasantly surprised by considering this is a 48 dollar batmobile uh wouldn't have expected the level of detail that's in this batmobile i was very impressed um good play functionality as well as good display function as well uh, highly recommend this if you have not picked this up. It's only forty-eight dollars retail in the U.S. Um, I might I'm thinking about not. I might actually not pick up the Batwing companion set that goes with this, um, especially like in the um, the hat piece that's on the Joker minifig in that particular set. But I'll get that later. Um, for now, this was a very good set. I highly recommend it. And that actually concludes my review. If you like what you've seen, please give me a like and a follow. Subscribe to my channel. I could, I could really use the, you know, as many followers as I can get. Um, stay tuned for more content and keep on building. Bye.